Good morning, good morning, good morning everybody. How are you all going today? I hope you guys are doing well. Janine here again guys, rocking it out from Auckland, New Zealand. Yes I am. This morning guys is a very, very, very fast, quick hair care tutorial about Philip B's Mega Curl Enhancer and his Russian Amber Imperial Mousse for hair care. Woo! This stuff here is expensive guys. It's $93 for the Mega Curl Enhancer. I want to see how it works. I haven't used it yet. I am looking for anything that's going to make my hair look great. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this $93 guys for a hair cream. What? Honestly, what? This stuff better be good. So it says repair dry strands, tame frizz and lock in supple definition. Made with time release botanical moisturizers, our light satiny styling cream makes naturally wavy hair especially pretty and leaves curly hair super soft, glossy and beautifully defined. I am so interested guys to try this one. I've also bought his mousse and this is Philip B's Russian Amber Imperial Mousse. And this stuff here guys was $65. A $65 mousse? My normal mousse that I usually buy, well the Joyco Joy Whip was like 25 and I thought that was expensive. So I am very interested guys to see what these two are going to do for my hair today. And let's just see eh, because it better be doing something damn amazing for that price. I do like Philip B's gel. I've been using his gel quite a lot. Um, that was about $60. It's really, really good. I love that stuff. It's got a really strong hold. Doesn't go all white and flaky. It's really, really nice. So, so what's so special about this mousse? Take your hair to new heights. This volumizing wonder turns flat, lifeless strands into big, sexy, glossy hair. The alcohol-free formula provides instant, long-lasting fullness while infusing hair with moisture and shine and laced with the opulent scent of pure Russian amber. It also doubles as a hair perfume. That's interesting. Okay, let's give these two a whirl guys and see how amazing these are for the price. So if that's something that you guys want to see, Philip B's mousse in action, please keep watching guys as I'm going to be taking little screenshots throughout the day and we will see, we will check out what what this $94 hair cream can do and the $65 most. A better work wonders. Check you guys soon. Okay my beautiful peeps, we've got to get this done pretty quickly eh, because my hair dries out really fast. So I think I'll start with his Mega Curl Enhancer, the $95. $95? 95 or 94 dollar uh, mega curl enhancer so let's get, ooh, i don't want to waste it it's so expensive it feels nice it feels quite glossy mm, it smells really nice i don't know if it's 94 dollars worth though guys for a hair cream mind you in saying that um some of my curastas mousses that i have bought in the past haven't been far off 95 dollars uh, the Kirastas, I'm going to put some more in, the Kirastas Oleo Curl is one, and that bottle was actually bigger than um, those. I think the Kirastas Oleo and Discipline Curl are about 80 something, and this one's a bit bigger, but still this is the most expensive one, so let's try it. Okay, let's put in this one here, the Russian Amber Imperial Mousse for $65. It's very luxe, I mean look it's gold can, gold and black is always really luxe looking. And it looks very glossy like, like meringues guys. I'm going to put that much in. I usually go harder than that. But that will just check that out for now. So I'll just tweak my hair a bit, put it in the position that I want it today. And let's see guys how these two products work today. I'm going to put on a very, very fast, fast face now and I'll come back to you after I've done that just to see if there's any change. Okay my gorgeous peeps, I'm back. I've done my base, um, just wearing the NARS matte 
soft complete foundation now I just want to do a very quick 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 look it's gonna be nothing much I'm just gonna use a bit of this new hourglass have you guys seen this the new hourglass eternal light ambient lighting palette volume 3 my gosh just got this one in guys so very dark Woo, check that out look how dark it is it's the darkest one out of the lot I love it so I'm going to use that as just a bit of an eyeshadow today I'm going to do some bronzing with it and that's it eyeliner and obviously eyebrows I'm going to go for this one here just as my eyeshadow let's get in there eh it's going to be a very quick look Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Could have even gone to that darker one actually. Get that in the crease. Oh, it's shiny. Oh, shivers. Haven't used this yet. Ooh, don't know about that, guys. A shimmer in the crease. We'll go for the other one. We'll go for the middle one here, eh? Because that is way too shimmery. Damn it. It's a bit of a mistake. <laughs> that looks okay. I mean, hmm. A bit more darky, I think, on the outside here. I have to have that dimension, guys, on the outer corner. Just want a fast, 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 fast look. Jeepers. Not too bad, not too bad. I'm not even going to go under the bottom lash line today. It's all about the uh, hair. I'm going to use this little brush here and we are going to just bronze up the face a little bit with this. I'm dying to use this palette. Volume 3, guys. So let's just get the fluffy, it's a lovely fluffy brush and just swipe through all three colours. Nice. Nice, guys. Ooh. Didn't even tap off, you know, because a bit of structure to that face. Excess up here. Really blend that in though. Just chisel out that jaw a little bit, especially because I'm wearing a turtleneck. Blush, so we're going to use Natasha Denona's beautiful new Rose Cheek Duo. Her new one, it's lovely, it's tiny. Can my brush get in there? We'll use the blushy part first. I love her stuff. Just for a bit of colour. Use a small brush when you're going to have a small brush when you're using this little thing. The colour. And then I'll just turn my brush because I can't be bothered getting a new one and with the highlight don't forget I've already got um, Charlotte's stuff on gosh that's beautiful oh you can't beat Natasha Nona's highlights honestly okay uh, quick 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 super fast eyebrow I am going to do the rest of it guys and then I will come back to you guys eh because I need to get going hold on up okay my peeps I have finished my face just done um used a little bit of my new NARS lippy and band red that one there which isn't too ready it's very nice it's kind of balmy actually last thing I'm going to do guys is just you know check the old hair it feels good Feels good, but I will be checking in with you guys during the day. Let's check out the power of a 95. Is it 95? Let me check. Don't want you guys grilling me. 93 or 94 dollar uh, hair cream and the 65 dollar mousse eh, from Philip B. Let's check out the staying power. Let's see what it does to my hair once it dries. So that'll be interesting. A uh, last thing I'm going to do just as a touch up guys is use my beautiful Winx Beauty hair powder eh, because I love this stuff guys and because my hair needs some more fullness in it I always do this so today is no exception. Just get around that hairline you know everyone's got an odd hairline guys and this makes a huge difference it gets rid of the greys and 
you know, gives you a little bit of time before you can go back to the hairdressers or dye your hair. It also makes everything look really straight and uniform, the hairline, you know. Any thinning parts of your hair, it will straighten it out. Temporary, it's all temporary. See, like, when I pull my hair back like that, you know, that's just a natural way that my hair goes. You'll see, like, a line. So if I did want to wear a pony or something like that, I would just touch up if I felt like it. I mean, I don't always do that, guys. Can't be too bloody pedantic, but. So that's me, guys, and I will catch you guys soon, and we will see how this fillet B Mega Cool Enhancer and his mousse works. I'll catch you guys soon. So yeah, here's me next to the mirror, guys, in, in proper daylight. Yeah, it looks very glossy. I like it. I do like the effect. Volumizing, yeah, it looks good. In saying that, I guess that I could actually get this effect with something cheaper. Um, even my Joyco Joy Whip's pretty awesome. But yeah, it's very glossy and I can feel, since I'm going like this on my hand, I can feel like it's a bit of slickness or some kind of gloss or oil in it. It's nice. I will keep on checking in, like my next check-in will be maybe just before I finish work and then I'll show you when I actually get home what it looks like. But I've, as promised guys, I've got my little Winx Beauty powder that I bring in my handbag with me. Now my hair's dry guys, this is when I really like to touch up and just make sure. Your hair always looks quite thin when it's wet. Anyone's would, you know, straight or curly. And that'll be it, but yeah, I like it. Okay guys, I will catch you up soon um, in a couple of hours later on in the day, maybe before I finish work. And then we will also check in on my hair when I get home. Just to see how this has held up. What be long, guys. Hello guys, it's my little chicken. It is almost four o'clock now. And what do you think of the hair, guys? It's not as glossy as what it was, but I think it's still pretty good. You think it still looks okay? It feels very fluffy now. So, not sure guys, but we will check in when I get home tonight and see how it is. I really feel like tying it up, it just feels too puffy for me. Definitely is volumizing, I have to say that. I will check you guys when I get home and then we'll have a little look. Hello, hello, hello my gorgeous peeps, how you all going? I'm back from work now, my gosh, what do you think about this hair? I have been so tempted to tie it up all day guys, but um, I have not because I really wanted to show you what it looks like, I mean it's very volumized, <sighs> not sure if I like it guys, not sure if I like it, but this is the whole day wear test guys for Philip B's Mega Curl Enhancer for $93 and Philip B's Russian Amber Imperial Mousse for $65. Do you think this these products are worth it? The hair was very very glossy today um, but it's kind of lost a little bit of its luster, well so have I. Oh, I feel so tired. But yeah, I like it. I mean, it is very volumizing. It would look, I don't know. I, I just feel like tying it up, you know, tying it up. But yeah, like that. Um, <laughs> let me know what your thoughts are on these two expensive products. And if you think that you would ever pick these up. I quite like them. I'll keep using them, of course. And yeah, keep checking it out. Okay, my peeps. Catch you up on another awesome video, eh? Have a great morning, day or night, wherever you are in the world. Take care, guys.